Hello Hot Wheels and Matchbox Car Collectors. So today I have a pretty interesting video of a camping trailer. So this camping trailer is not a Hot Wheel trailer or a Matchbox trailer. It is actually a green light trailer. So it is actually a pretty green light item. I usually don't collect green lights because they're pretty expensive, but the trailer was $23. And after seeing it at... What, what do you call it? Uh, Hobby Lobby, it was about $35. So it actually was about ten, more than $10 off, so I decided to buy it. So what this is, is a green light hitch and tow, and the model of the trailer is a 1964 Winnebago 216. So in this video, we're just going to be taking a like, just look at the final details, because let me tell you, there are lots of details in the in this trailer. First to start off, that is just a reflection right there. I know it does look like a crack on the window, but it's just the reflection of the car because see when I move it, it disappears. So the first thing that I noticed on there is they have the, prop the propane tanks on the front. And when you turn this little knob right here, it makes the trailer go lower or higher. You see the t uh, you can see the trailer inching up just a little bit. So there are also just a couple of things that open on this trailer, but inside the trailer is a bed, a stove, some countertops, a dining ta uh, a eating table to eat on. So see this opens up right here. And if I can move in a little bit, you can see there's a stove in there. It's a really detailed stove. Um, it's kind of dark inside, so I'm gonna try to get a little bit, a little flashlight to show you. So here we go. I've got the flashlight. Even that doesn't help, but you can see you can, there's a little bit of details. You can see the countertop in there, but I really haven't seen the bed in there because this is pretty much all you can see because the windows are kind of tinted. But here you go, you can kind of see, and this, not the stove, that's the dishwasher. You can see the little eating spot in there. So that's the best I can show the interior right there. So I'm going to show you the next side. So the door kind of does close funky, but I did notice this on the other models that they made. There we go. So I always move to the front, and I already told you that there you can make the, you can level out the trailer. Now I do really admire the the work that they how much detail they put into the models that they make. So green light, even though I don't have lots of them, but I really do give you a thumbs up about the models that you make. So as you can see, the this little hatch right here opens up. You can see a little bit inside the trailer. So here on the side of the trailer, you got the classic hubcaps on there. And the three windows, my bad. Four. And you also got the turn signals on both sides. So as we move to the back, it's a basic bag, small window since the bed is right there, so you can put a curtain over. So this part right here doesn't open, which I'm not too disappointed about. Well, I'm not disappointed at all, because after all the great details on this trailer. So right here we got like a little... I'm not sure what these are, but... Here's a good look at the roof. Also, the stoplights has the logo on the front. See, even the smallest details make the car thing look so realistic. Sorry, the camera's shaking so bad. You can see the bolts right in there. So, so uh, there. This thing came with a little uh, ex, little, uh, little roof cover almost like this. Sometimes it's kind of, not I don't want to say hard to put on, but it doesn't stick on 
as good, but still really cool, you can see. Here's another top view of the trailer. This thing is so realistic where you can see the little lumps on the top of it. So I will be collecting more of these trailers in the next videos. And I usually I know I only make videos of mostly Hot <coughs> Wheels or Matchbox and sometimes some other companies. But I thought today this would be a cool little thing to review since I've just got it. Thank you so much for watching the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and leave a comment down below. And if there's a certain type of car that you would like to see in the next video, please let me know by commenting on one of my newer videos. Suggesting a any type of car and I can probably get a hold of it. And see thank you for watching the video and I'll see you next time.